Hey guys, it's Miss Alicia and I'm in my backyard. Today, me, Miss Amanda and Emily thought we'd want to do a little lesson about our pets. Pets are living things, animals that we keep and take care of. Miss Alicia's had a very exciting day with her dogs. Two of them broke the fence and ran away. But guess what? I managed to get some video, so you guys are gonna get to watch that and learn about pets. We have to have a fence in our yard to keep the dogs in or else they'd run away all around the neighborhood and into the woods. The fence keeps our dogs safe and they've got a nice yard to roam in. Mr. Max just fixed the fence because Tilly was pushing out and escaping. Do you guys think Tilly's gonna escape again? Let's see. What do you think, Mr. Max? Maybe she will. I hope not. We built the fence to keep them safe. Meet Winston. He's a good boy. He's one of my small dogs. Winston likes to be in the sun and bark at the neighbor dogs. What a good boy, Winston. He's the tiniest of my dogs and the oldest. He doesn't know he's a tiny dog. He thinks he's big. Oh, here comes Winston. He wants to be a star too. Bye Cleveland. Hello. She's the biggest dog. You can see how little Cleveland is next to her and Winston. Willow likes to bark and run around the yard. She's a very good this is girl. Tilly. Tilly's resting in the shade under the porch. She ran away today, so she's found a cozy spot to cool off, and Cleveland wants it to be the star still again. Cleveland, you want to be in all my movies, huh? Tilly's a good girl, even though she runs away sometimes. Aren't you, Tilly? You can see Willow has a lot of fur. Something that I need to do with Willow is to brush her to keep her fur under control. Winston also needs to be groomed and Tilly also. But right now the dog groomers are closed like school. So Miss Alicia's gonna have to figure it out on her own. There's tiny Cleveland. I think he's looking for the hole to see if he can escape this time. What a bad little dog. Also, my dogs are living things. So they require food and water and a shelter. They live in the house with us, but they like to spend their days outside smelling and barking and running around in the grass. Miss Alicia also needs to mow her yard. Maybe I'll catch up with those things over spring break. Breeze. Breeze is a good girl. Breeze likes to stay inside and be with the children. She's a slick little black dog. Breeze also needs to go outside too though and run around and get her energy out. But she and Tilly have to take turns because sometimes they don't get along. Wow, Miss Alicia sure does have a variety of dogs. Do you know what a variety means? It means all different kinds. I have big dogs, I have some little dogs, I have mostly furry dogs, some shaggy dogs, and one little slick dog. Let's meet Miss Amanda's pets next. This is my doggy Panda. She's a Boston Terrier, and she's black and white. She just turned four years old. This is Texi. He's a rat terrier, men pen, chihuahua mix, and his color is kind of brownish, reddish, orange. And he is going to be eight in June. This is Coco, friends, and she's a rabbit, a bunny rabbit. She, too, is black and white, just like Panda. Coco is also a rest. Miss Amanda has some cute little pets, too. Let's meet Miss Emily's pet and see what kind she has. Super excited. Hi, boys. It's Miss Emily. I'm coming to you today because I want to show you guys a special friend of mine. So hold on one second. I got to go get her. This is my cat, Rowan. I've had Rowan since I was a sophomore in college, so she'll be about 
eight years old in June. Um, she is a pastel calico, which means her colors are a little bit more dull than normal calicos, but she's got a little bit of orange, some brown, white, gray. She's all sorts of colors, and you probably can't see, but she's got these really pretty green eyes. She also doesn't like to be held for too long. But I just wanted to show you to her because she's someone who's very important and special to me, and I love her very much. Say, hey, Rowan. She's not into it. There you go. Now I'm covered in cat hair. I just wanted you guys to meet her. She's a pretty funny little kitty. She's got a lot of sass and attitude. I hope you're enjoying your time at home with hopefully maybe your pets and your families. I love you guys and I miss you. Hey guys, we've well, got to meet all of our pets and I've got Cleveland with me. Hi, say hi Cleveland. Look at him wave his tiny paw. Anyways, that sure was fun. I have some questions for you guys. Who out of Miss Alicia, Miss Amanda, and Miss Emily has the most pets? Who has dogs? Who has cats? And who has another kind of pet that's not a dog or a cat? Hmm. Well, I can't wait to get back at school and we can talk about your pets too. And I hope you're enjoying this time at home. Love you boys. See you soon.